Uh, hello and welcome to another update. In this one, we'll be covering a few updates. So starting out, we have an update in Makivka, where we see here the Russian forces have managed to capture the fire station, as well as the densest plant here in the center. So they've broken through the center and now have a presence in the western part of the city. Then we also see here the Russian forces have been pushed back by Chernobyl where the Ukrainian forces have managed to capture these uh, forest patches here to the west of the village. Then we see here the Russian forces managed to advance on the whole Bakhmut front, where they have managed to push into the fortified position of the Ukrainian forces here to the northeast of the western in the residential area with the high-rise buildings. Then we also see them fight by the hospital. So they haven't completely captured it yet, but they are fighting by it. Then we see fighting advancing and advancements on the whole front line as Russian forces try to advance everywhere and fighting continues in these areas. Then we move on to the update by Remiland, where he says that the supply road through Pomove, the road has not been physically reached. There's fighting over the hill just off the road. UA has ducked in massively there, but there is significant progress for the VV, VDV units. And with this update from Syriac Maps, we can see the Russian forces managed to take control over the hill here to the northwest of the road, and fighting is continued by the road itself. And to the very east, the Russian forces managed to capture the last final part east of the railways, which means that the Russian forces now have full control over the railways that go through the center of the city. So with this, all of the fighting has now reached the western part of the city. This was also reported by Deep State Map. So as we can see, the Russian forces have full control over the railways that go through the center of the city. Then there's this video here where we see that there is heavy fog within the city. So the visibility should be very bad. Unless there are proper uh, sights, uh, then it's difficult for anyone to see through these areas. And even night vision gear will have a hard time seeing through the smoke. So with this, there is difficulty in actually advancing or counterattacking or repelling attacks. Everything is just more difficult as there's poor visibility. And with the latest update from Remy, he says that the Ukrainians are attempting uh, counterattacks uh, to get into Bahut by the uh, road by Humove, That He mentioned that three columns have attempted, but they were all destroyed. So there seems to be heavy fighting by the road itself, and both sides are intensifying their attacks in this area, where the Ukrainians are trying to hold the road and push back the Russian forces, while the Russian forces are trying to take control over the road and prevent the last supply route in and out of the city. And that is all for this update. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.